Hello guys, I'm going to tell direct recon here, and it's for the 11th of next year. I have some info on you. The tail directs will be very entertaining. We won't get as many years as we're in a pre-COVID year. Yeah. Nintendo decided to go for the trailer that Mario 3D World about the few to get out of the way since it's coming out in over a month. The first day will direct will be on February 11th, the day before the game comes out. Here's what they'll show. A sequel to Buffer the Wild will kick off the showcase. It won't be anything massive. There's a trailer that shows of some gameplay, but will reveal some massive window. October 2021. The name is Zelda Breath of the Darkness. A new trailer for Normal Heroes 3 is shown off, giving us the full scope of the game. It will be similar to Normal Hero 1 and the Den Desperate Struggle. It will release in May. March Hunter Rise will get a final trailer. We're hyping us up for March release. Korea Fighters 2 will get a mention showing us more characters for that game. With the immediate release, it will say stay tuned to Zoo for more Kirby news. Square Enix will throw their hat into some ports of entire Final Fantasy XIV trilogy and a tease of an upcoming Swiss exclusive Final Fantasy project. Hollow Knight Silk Song and Final Soul Up will get to release date on our April 16th. Konami announced Metal Gear Anniversary Collection of the real SMS chat Metal Gear, Metal Gear Solid 2, Metal Gear Solid, and Metal Gear Solid 2 1, one Sons of Liberty, Metal Gear Solid, Metal Gear 2 Solid Snake, Metal Gear Solid 3, Snake Eater, and Metal Gear Solid 4. Given the size of size these games will be priced at 60, it will be released in July. The next mass fight is, is Class Bandicoot with Coco as an altered skin. Released in March. But yep, that's basically about, Nintendo, about this Nintendo Direct Week. Do you believe in it, or do you believe it's fake? Goodbye.